Good evening, Austin here. I thought I'd do a review on the bucket on a belt that I recently purchased as I was getting a bit fed up of bending down and having to keep putting my squeegees and applicators back into my bucket or to try to prop them on top of the bucket, vice versa, when not using them. So I purchased a bucket on a belt. I've seen many people use them and many people on YouTube have them. So I thought, let's give it a go. So I purchased this one on Amazon. I believe it was about $17.99. It's an unbranded bucket on a belt. And also it's an ambidextrous universal bucket on a belt. So I'm left-handed. Majority of the people in the UK are right-handed, but with this one, it's an equal mirror each side, which is fantastic and gives you the ability to put your squeegees and your applicators in from either side and to be able to access them easily when working but talking a bit more about the bucket on the belt it's black it's um very very heavy duty very well made and constructed it did have a belt buckle with a loop on it unfortunately that loop and that buckle made it hang down my leg far too much so i've cut the buckle off and the belt loop and i've simply bent a piece of aluminium filler wire which would be used for TIG stick welding or TIG welding and bent that into a, a fixture on my belt which I'll talk more about in a minute. So the overall dimensions of the bucket on the belt it's about 350 millimeters or about 12 and a quarter inches 100 mil four inches wide and the actual internals so you have I would say 12 and a half inches of actual cavity space in the main body of the unit and then you've got the two other outers which are 200 mil depth and then the middle single which is about 210 millimeters in depth so with this bucket design as you can see nice spacious equal mirrored inside so that side is exactly the same as the other side so for me it's on the left hand side of my working belt um, i tend to use a larger 18 inch squeegee which sits in there perfectly and also the same size applicator or scrubber like so like so but it works really well i tend to use this dry i still have my bucket at this one is an 18 litre hunger bucket I have that one full of my warm water and soap solution and instead of bending down having to prop the squeegee on the bucket or to try to hang it on its hanging point or to put the applicator into its strainer tray it can be quite cumbersome um, and quite time consuming also so I lay on my soap with my applicator I've got my squeegee I clean my glass and then detail I reach my scrim and then vice versa move on to the next window out comes the applicator then out comes the squeegee so fantastic piece of kit it's really made my job a lot easier and very good value for money so talking a bit more about the belt i was looking at belts and i saw the unger the two unger belts they do a thinner black belt with loops which I believe is about $24.99 and they do the Unger padded working belt. I actually found a very similar designed black working belt on Amazon. It wasn't that expensive. I'll post a link in the description and the pricing etc on how you can go about getting this belt. Very nice black padded belt with the military molly or mole designed quick fit strip. So you've got two parallel pieces of webbing tape that are sewn which gives you a good fix in the lashing point on the right hand side of the belt i have two black spur tools black spur is a very affordable brand of tools and accessories which are available in the uk i've got some bungees which i believe are for 
either ground sheets or tarpaulins or scaffolding but they've got a fixed ball on one end so I've just threaded those through and then very easily I can just reach around to my right hand side and hang my scrim in the side of it and then pull it off as and when I need to. So very good working belt, fully adjustable, nice and padded on your hips as well. So after wearing this all day, you're not going to suffer from fatigue. It's not going to dig in. It's not going to give you an uncomfortable side. So it works very well. So, you know, applicator. I can also put a squeegee there, or a squeegee in the middle, which makes it fantastic. And then I still use the bucket. But I thought I'd do a quick review just to share my views on the bucket on a belt and for anyone else that's new to start window cleaning or wants to get into it it's something I highly recommend. If you like the video, if you have any questions leave them below in the comments. If you'd like to subscribe I'd appreciate that and don't forget to share it with your friends. Thank you very much.